Hi folks, day nine's hot tip centers on the importance of your environment or your setting. Depending on your goal, adjusting your environment can be a game changer in sustaining you toward reaching your goal. If you haven't done it already, consider setting the stage for achieving by setting yourself up for success. This is probably fairly evident and basic advice, but it bears some thought. Depending upon your goal, it might help you to gather, as Rhonda had recommended previously, all the items you need to complete your task and keeping them at the ready so you don't have to keep recreating the wheel. If music helps you get into a positive mood, energized for decluttering, Kathy, or chilled for writing, Aaron, then go find a speaker and set the mood. Or maybe you need a change of perspective. Maybe this can be enhanced by adding candles, plants, a humidifier. Maybe it will help to pull your hair up in a ponytail like Lemony Snicket's character Violet does when she's solving a problem. Or like Mr. Rogers when if you take off your blazer and put on your cozy sweater. Or maybe you just need a change of setting and you can go do your work somewhere else or, or find a new path to walk. Give a little thought to the subconscious influence that will make your psyche most inclined to stay on target and keep working toward your goal. So what are some of the adjustments you can make to focus your conscious and your subconscious mind? Well, reduce distractions. Turn off your phone or maybe put it on do not disturb. Maybe keep it, keep your little post-it notes, oh, they're upside down, Keep them nearby and keep track of where you left off yesterday and write yourself a message that you can read tomorrow. What do you need to be successful today? Successful tomorrow. Factor in a little compassion, a little comfort, and a little reward into your plan maybe. For my part, I'm going to go make myself a cup of tea, which always reminds me of my mom, and turn on some lights, a little classical music. I'm gonna flick on my fake candle, throw a blanket over my legs, and I'm gonna get to work. So you've got this, I've got this, get to work.